we're going to grow yeah. all the way up the wall. We're going to use our vertical space. We're going to use our vertical space. So, you know, right now, square footage is such a big deal. For a lot of people that don't have the available space, there are so many different solutions to grow vertically, grow up. Uh -huh. Many of them are really expensive. So I went to Ikea to just to figure out some really inexpensive solutions. So the first okay. thing we're going to start with is the pots beside you. Right. They just look like a regular pot. But what's neat about these guys here is we're going to go over and let's just see here. You can stack them like Lego. Stackables, yeah. And they're just going to click in, Good. just like that. And then all of a sudden, what happens is we're starting to get a little bit more. Just going to make sure we alternate. There Good. you go. So all of a sudden, you have a stackable pot. I'm going to let you got some herbs in behind there that you can just plant away. So what you're having is you have the square footage on the top, and then mm -hmm. now you also have the square footage. Just like a classic strawberry planter. Did you bring me your nice gloves? I didn't, but don't worry, it is a, a good potting soil that's there. You don't All have right. any concern. Is there mitt, any manure in this? There is no poo in this, okay. actually. I always this, have to this, have Yeah, this is poo-free. Okay. A little word of warning. I Once again, I say this to everybody out there. I shouldn't be planting this here? No, mint always goes in a container. Oh, Always. Whoops. No, in the pot. No, oh, okay, no in the pot, in the ground. Right. But don't ever put mint in your garden or it's going to grow in your lawn. It's going to grow oh, in your neighbor's oh, lawn. It's going to grow contain it. everything. So Yeah, I get it. That's the kind of idea that you can make, maximize that space. This is perfect for herbs. Isn't that the other beautiful? key about this, too, is that it has lots of soil that each one goes in. There was mm -hmm. two 30 liter bags that I used here. So that's going to mean it's not going to dry out. Make sure that you improve drainage by drilling holes in the bottom. Okay. So now you need so that those, ventilation. Those that's about thirty bucks. Okay. Right there. So all three that's of those. That's great. Thirty dollars from IKEA. IKEA nine ninety nine a container. Perfect. Right. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's good. Good price. Now these guys, two of these, a big one and a little one, ten dollars. Mm. And these are from IKEA as well, and they're usually used to put toys and things. But because it is fabric, mm -hmm. it'll still be number one breathable, but also it drains. Good. So meaning this is for an outdoor purpose. Don't try to put this in your home else you're going to have water running down your walls. <laughs> just to give you a good idea. But another way that you can, you know, I have some lettuces that are here. Early crop lettuces are fine. They burn out during the summer months. Right. But we can use this for some herbs and things like that that we can grow. Even you could even have some trailing different things that you're going to have. Even some cherry tomatoes sometimes will do fine in that as well. They so, look beautiful, but there's a function to them. That's why I like the idea of doing this, growing your herbs and your lettuce in these containers. And kids are going to love this. This They're is really fun. It. It's colorful. It's bright. Yeah. So a lot of wall solutions that I'm seeing in vertical gardening are like, I've seen them for 100 bucks. I've seen them they really, pricey. really expensive. So this here is $5.99. <laughs> $5.99. And, and it's four shoes, right? But cool. if you look at that, it each has a pocket. So those pockets have enough soil that will be in there. That will also drain. So when it's watering, drainable. And what okay. you can easily do is you can create a beautiful little wall planter out of them. Isn't this great? Yeah. This is a great idea. Can you keep them in the containers? Well, for Do just, like in for, real just life. for just display purposes, I put them in containers here. But in real life, I would fill each one of these pockets full of soil because yes. the more soil we have, the better it's going to be for the roots. Yeah. The better it's going to be for the overall plant. When you're watering, you want to water the top first and come down all the way through. All right. But we could put edible strawberries in this. Imagine that—a mm, wall of strawberries nice. that you just yeah, beautiful. We're going to talk about small fruits a little bit later in some Lovely. of the varieties. Then Looks this great. here, also for a vertical space, mm. a nice little plant ladder. This was the most expensive item that I have here. Okay. This was about $60. $60. Right? But this here totally is really doable. good. This could even be used inside the home where you could put air purifying plants. So you could, a little bit of a, just beautiful, nice little accessory. What a great idea. And it comes, the ladder comes with the hanging little pots? Yeah, so it comes with the ladder mm -hmm. and, uh, of course, the uh, pots that are there as well. So five containers as well. The only thing is, is that they, there's no drainage in the base of these, so you have to put a little bit of stone. Yeah. So that way the plants are like, number one killer is kindness, too much water and things mm -hmm. like that. Okay. And then finally, like as a hanging basket, Pretty. this one here, you can actually put five, six. We could have all our herbs, so we could have a pure oregano if we wanted to. We could have mm -hmm. creeping thyme that was here. We'd have, I just put pansies because... It's pretty. Pansies are my favorite flower. They're so cute. They really are. Like, look, they're so happy. Aren't they Hi. happy? Hi, how are you? <laughs> and you know, like, I can put them on <laughs> cakes. I can eat them. Mm. Ah. They're good. Ew. Ew. That's no. what they were saying. Ooh, do you? <laughs> <laughs> you ew. You ew. But there you go. You got this one here is about fifteen dollars per little planter that's there. So great ways for vertical space. Think about that too. If you don't have a lot of square footage this way, think about Grow growing, up. growing up. Yeah. I love that. 